friends. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Miss Jessica, and today we are going to be making some slime, and I am so excited. So let's go ahead and get started. So what you're gonna need to make your slime is a bowl to mix it in, some baking soda, just a little bit, not a box that big necessarily, but just a little, and some white glue. White school glue will work just fine. Some food coloring, I've got green with me today. And some contact solution. All right, so once you've got your materials gathered, let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing that we're gonna do is pour in our glue. We need four ounces of white glue. So I've got that here. I'm gonna go ahead and pour it into our bowl. I can get it open. Oof. That's difficult. This is going to be so fun. Okay. There we go. Boop. Put it all in there. All right, now we're gonna add a half a tablespoon of baking soda. Perfect. All right, and then we're gonna mix this and I'm just gonna use this because I forgot to grab anything else. I'm just gonna mix it all together here. It's kind of becoming a little pasty. A little thicker. And then I'm gonna add in just a couple of drops of our food coloring. A little goes a long way with food coloring. So you don't need very much at all. One, two. That should be plenty. We can always add more if we need to. Mix it up. Oh, look how cool. Woo. <laughs> okay, I'm having way too much fun with this. <laughs> Yay, a nice minty green. Very nice. All right. I need to go ahead and add in one tablespoon of our contact solution. I'm gonna just pour it right into my little mixing spoon I've been using. Hopefully that works. And the contact solution should make the consistency much less runny and more of a solid, slimy consistency. So I'm gonna pour it in. And then we stir again until it becomes slime. Oh my goodness. Ah. <laughs> Woo. I just keep stirring and stirring. Oh, that is so fun. Okay, I'm gonna try to, all right, the hands are gonna get messy now. I'm gonna go ahead and just mix it with my hand. So it's a little sticky. One thing to know is that if it's too sticky, you can add a little bit more contact solution um, until it's the right consistency that you're looking for. Straight to the bottom. All right, I think it's pretty well mixed. <laughs> Now you're supposed to go ahead and start kneading. Okay, so yeah, it's still pretty sticky. We might need to add more contact solution, but we're just gonna go ahead and knead the slime with our hands. It's so messy. <laughs> Woo. 
One thing, speaking of messes, one thing to keep in mind with this slime is that you do not want to get this on any kind of fabric or clothing and let it dry. If you do that, you will not be able to get it out again. It is going to solidify like concrete and you'll just have a slimy piece of fabric forever, which we don't want. So... With the kneading, it is definitely getting less sticky as the contact solution works its way through. Ah. <laughs> Pop. Okay, this is fun. Yay. All right, I think we have it. I don't think we need to add anything else. Ooh, it's stretchy and fun. Yay. So yeah, and you can make this recipe bigger if you wanna double it and have even more slime. Do whatever you want, it'll be great. All right guys, thanks for watching. Have fun with your slime.